in the previous video clip I'd initially said that you want to clip in forwards in the direction that you you want to take off that's all very well when you're beginning and you're doing a, a forward start because you clip in you take your risers you pull it up and you keep going if you don't have a motor on your back you can also do that because it's quite easy once you clipped in to turn under the riser into the back start position however if you're flying motorized paragliders and you've got this big propeller spinning on your back it's a little bit impractical to clip in forwards then try and duck under or turn under the riser because you're likely to get the line stuck in your prop so I'm going to show you another way now where you clip in facing your glider it's a lot safer because your propellers facing away from all your lines and your canopy and um, it just means you can also take off on your own you don't need assistance all right what we do suppose we had an engine on our back we're facing our canopy we're going to clip in but you can imagine if we don't make proviso and 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 we we simply clip the risers crossed when we turn around we're going to put a half twist in them so what we do here is we we accommodate that all right first thing is to decide if I'm going to turn around to my left or if I'm going to turn around to my right suppose this time we're going to turn to our left okay so what we do after our pre-flight check all our lines are free this is the direction that it's going to fly through the air if I'm turning to my left I put a 180 degree twist in the entire riser in the direction that I'm going to turn in other words to my left I'm now looking at the back side of the riser all right and I clip it directly across my chest in the opposite side I'm still looking at the back of it but it's had a half twist in the direction that I'm going to to turn with my other riser all right that is the direction that it would normally fly through the air I've decided I'm turning to my left so I put a half 180 degree twist in it to my left in the direction that I'm going to I'm going to to fly now this is the important part this riser in other words the one that goes to the side that I'm going to turn to to my left must be on the top all right this one's coming to the left side I'm turning to the left it must travel on top of the other riser that I've already clipped into okay all right now we clipped in the motor's still going on our back it's well away from the lines <coughs> And there's no no problems right the next very important thing to remember is unlike the previous video clip where left was left and right is right and we pulled it up we turned around we dropped the risers or the toggles and then we we got hold of them again and we took off this is another method where when we turn around we simply unwinding ourselves okay it's a little bit more complicated to start with because what we got to got to got to establish is our hands are crossed so in other words this hand is controlling that wing this hand is controlling that wing the previous video clip was simply this hand controlled that one and this one controlled that wing all right but anyway you can decide after you've you figured this out which which one you prefer right for the method where we don't drop our toggles when we turn around this is quite important the toggle that is on on top I mean the whole riser that's on top okay together with its toggle indicates that I'm turning to the left this corresponding toggle steering toggle I must take hold of by going over okay so let me show you again both my toggles are hanging down the one that is attached to the left hand side in other words the one on top I must reach over and actually take hold of it right so in other words we reach over the one that's underneath we simply take hold of by reaching underneath okay this is our steering configuration the same way as the previous video clip what I'm doing is we're taking hold of the front risers and we are simply steering as, as need be in other words the canopy comes up I need to steer to the right I'm steering to the right if I need to steer to the left I simply swap the front risers and I steer however always remember now that my right toggle is controlling that wing tip and my left 
hand and Togo was controlling that wingtip. The beauty with this is now, once the risers are up, all I'm simply doing is I'm unwinding myself. I don't have to drop any toggles. There's no a couple of second delay where the toggles are dropped. I've turned around and I've grabbed them. All right. Pay attention now, please. We're going to try and pull this up.